Hey guys, Channel Lego Moore here with another Lego Next Tonight's 2018 set review. Set number is 72003. This is the Berserker Bomber. It has 369 pieces, three minifigures, and it retails for $30 here in the United States. So let's look at the packaging. You can see it looks very good. Um, we like the design of it. And you can also see the back of there as well. And we also do get one instruction manual as well with a uh, the ads for the other sets for next nights and then like a Lego life so let's get on with the minifigures of the set and we'll start off with Macy Halbert herself and this version is exclusive to the set so far she has her Murloc power which is the um, mace of Murloc and she has this uh, jetpack build as you can see here which you can uh, pose a little up and they use um, the design of it and you can easily remove that and you can see her shield and then her mace which has this really nice design to it and her helmet which looks good too and again you can see the red coloring on her just a little better look there and then there's the alternate face she has the newer style of armor called the other knight's house so you can see the printing on her there's the back print on Macy. So, this is the only way to get Macy in this version. So, let's move on with our next minifigure. I'm going to put this back on. We'll move on with our um, Mecha Biter. And moving on, we have the Mecha Biter right here. Uh, just your standard um, main goon for 2018. And you can see the back print, which it does show the face with the helmet, so I kind of wish it had armor to cover it up. But you can see there is the Mecha Biter minifigure. And then we have one of my favorite minifigures of the 2018 Nexonite sets. It is the Berserker himself. And you can see we have the Berserker right here. And he has his Nexo power, which is called Orbital Strike. And it has the newer style of shield. He also has the, um, you can move the, uh, the shield. And then you can put this nice weapon, which uses that, um, blade that we got a little while back. You can see the printing on him. And then he has the helmet with the spikes. And it is supposed to cover the face. But you can remove the face print there. And you can see a better look at that face. It really looks kind of menacing, which is crazy. And then you can see the alternate face on the back right there, which looks really cool. I like that face mask a lot. And then you can see the rest of the print on the Berserker. Again, great minifigure. Um, the face print is really the biggest draw with this. And then you can just cover this back up. And let's look at the set itself. So... Before we get to the main bomber part, we have this little mech right here, which you can put the mecha biter right in. So what you do is you pull this down. You can see there's a control panel in there, which has a sticker right there. And you can remove the spear. And you can put the mecha biter right in. So it has like that battle suit design that we got from Nexonites. So again, you could just um, you can probably make it stand, make them stand up to... Got a better, there we go, that's better. So we make it uh, stick out a bit, which that's I believe what it's supposed to do. Actually, so I like that, you can see. And it does have articulation within the legs. So again, you can move the legs a bit, as well as the feet, and even the arms can move. And there's then the tech critter, which you can fire off, and you can see we do get a few of those in the set and you can make them look like hands which is really cool so again you can just stick the um, the guy right in so mecha buyer goes right in and you can somewhat close it up a bit it's a little tough to get them in there but once you get it I think it works very good it's really hard to close it in on him but I think you really have to make them stand up, which is kind of sad. I kind of wish you can easily uh, put him right in. So, again, just 
lock them in place, but you can see a little better look there. Now let's move on with the Berserker Bomber. And what you can see is the nice black and trans green design looks really good. You can see we have some of these 2x2s uh, two as well, uh, bricks. You can attach the mech right on to the Berserker Bomber, which is really cool. So you can really hide them right in there. You can make them fly. And you can see we also have some stickers as well. You can see the design there. And then, of course, the Nexo Shield uh, pieces with the stickers on them. You have this nice printed eye, which you can see throughout. That's where the Berserker can look. And you can put the shield right there. And then also attach the weapons on each side of the bomber. So you can put the spear there. And also the other side, you can lift open the cockpit, which has um, some stickers for controls. And, of course, the Berserker goes right inside the center. You can put them right in there. And, of course, you can then close them up there. The reason why they don't cover the entirety of the cockpit up is because of the big horns, which makes sense. And then the Berserker looks through the big eye there. You can also move the wings a bit to get the stud shooters open and ready to attack. You can lift these parts up as well. So you can, you can, you can actually move these around and you just fire off, just as you can see, you can fire off the studs. And once you do that, you can also pull this back. If you want to dive bomb and attack Macy, which you can do that. And again, you can just see the nice uh, blazer blasts in the front. The blasters in the front look really good. Side of it looks good too. Again, you can just see. I really like the um, the design of it. it. Looks more full with the mech inside, so you can easily, if you want, just take out the mech, just like that. Just detach it from there, and that about does it with um, this set. Honestly, um, you can see the underside looks pretty good. You do have some white pieces, but it fits because of the color scheme with the uh, bad guys. So yeah. That is it for the Berserker Bomber. So $30 set. I think it's a good deal. Um, you do get the Berserker minifigure, which is really cool. Um, I really like that face print. You also get a little bit of a mech design, like a little battle suit mech, which is really cool inside as well, which really fits in behind the um, Berserker Bomber very well. And Macy's pretty cool too because you can only get her in this set. Even though the jetpack may not be the best looking, I still think it's a good set. So $30, yeah, it's a good set. I recommend it for sure. And it's one of the best of the Nexonites 2018 sets. Um, I don't know if it's the best one, but it's a good set, especially with the villain's vehicles. I think they're really good. So let me guys know what you think down below in the comments about this set. And let me guys know. Thanks for watching.